Hello YouTubers and welcome to to one of the CK custom custom big reviews. Today I, I made some Doctor Who props. I made quite a few of them. I thought I'd put them on a video. Anyway, here's my most favourite one, which is the Dimension Fault from the next Doctor. Basically, what this is made of tin foil, plastine and a toothpick. This bit here is the toothpick, this bit, this bit, and this bit is the foil, and this bit is the plastic. Basically what I did was make a sausage out of tin foil and put it there, put it on and wrapped it around there and there. Now I've got another bit and wrapped it around to make it this bit. And I made a cone to sew it in the glued it glued it in. Now wrapped it around plastic and put wrapped this in tin foil. My next one is my small some of my smaller ones, which is the Master's Ring. Too bad it doesn't fit. And this one is with this one didn't go much well. It's a bit too floppy, which is a dark thick alien bomb rack. Which is too floppy. I should get some cardboard but can be asked. And this one is, which has no detail whatsoever, because like, so this is too small, which is the Doctor's Frog Watch. Maybe fits into, I don't know if this fits into the Doctor. Hey, what do you know? It fits. I know it also fits into the Master's hand as well. Let's take that, my custom. Some dot some doctor, I can't remember which one it was. I don't even remember. And this one's a chameleon arch from Human Nature. Take this doctor. And this actually fits. Too bad the watch doesn't. And here's some Peter Davison ones that I did, which is his celery. And his cricket hat. Basically, what I did was for the hat was get a Tom Baker head, sculpt four over it, and I painted it white, and then a red ring around it. And this also fits. This is another Peter Davison prop, which I'm absolutely ashamed of. It's completely rubbish, it doesn't fit, it doesn't even look right, which is his brainy specs. See, it doesn't f it doesn't look right. And worst of all, it doesn't even look right, or it, do it doesn't even fit. And this one, that one, I'm absolutely ashamed of. That one's the worst thing I've ever made. Hello YouTubers, and welcome to to one of the CK custom custom big reviews. Today I, I made some Doctor Who props. I made quite a few of them. I thought I'd put them on a video. Anyway, here's my most favourite one, which is the Dimension Fault from the next Doctor. Basically what this is made of tin foil, plastine and a toothpick. This bit here is the toothpick. This bit this bit, and this bit is the foil, and this bit is the plastic. Basically what I did was make a sausage out of tin foil and put it there. Put it on and wrapped it around there and there. Now I've got another bit and wrapped it around to make it this bit. And I made a cone to sew it in the... Glued it, glued it in. And I wrapped it around plastic and put, wrapped this in tin foil. My next one is my small some of my smaller ones which is the master's ring too bad it doesn't fit and this one is with this one didn't go much well it's a bit too floppy which is a dark thick alien bomb rack which is too floppy 
I should get some cardboard, but can be asked. And this one is which has no detail whatsoever, because like, so this is too small, which is the Doctor's Rob Watch. Maybe it fits into, I don't know if this fits into the Doctor. Anybody know it fits? I know it also fits in the master's hand as well. Let's take that my custom. Some dot. Some doctor. I can't remember which one it was. I can't even remember. And this one's a chameleon arch from Human Nature. Take this doctor. And this actually fits. Too bad the watch doesn't. And here's some Peter Davison ones that I did, which is his celery and his cricket hat. Basically, what I did was the hat was get a Tom Baker head, sculpt four over it, and I painted it white and a red ring around it and this also fits this is another Peter Davison prop which I'm absolutely ashamed of it's completely rubbish it doesn't fit it doesn't even look right which is his brainy specs see it doesn't f it doesn't look right and worst of all it doesn't even look right or it, do and it doesn't even fit and this one, that one, I'm absolutely ashamed of. That one's the worst thing I've ever made.